ISO – IEC 20000 is the first international standard for IT service management. It was developed in 2005, by ISO – IEC JTC1, SC7 and revised in 2011. It is based on and intended to supersede the earlier BS 15000 that was developed by BSI Group. ISO IEC 20000, like its BS 15000 predecessor, was originally developed to reflect best practice guidance contained within the ITIL Information Technology Infrastructure Library framework reference needed, although it equally supports other IT service management frameworks and approaches, including Microsoft Operations Framework and components of ISACA's COBIT framework. The differentiation between ISO, IEC 20000 and BS 15000 has been addressed by Jenny Dugmore. The standard was first published in December 2005. In June 2011, the ISO, IEC 20000 1 2005 was updated to ISO, IEC 20000 1 2011. In February 2012, ISO IEC 20000-2-2005 was updated to ISO IEC 20000-2-2012. ISO 20000-1 is currently undergoing revision by ISO, specifically ISO IEC JTC1 SC40 it service management and IT governance. The proposed revision is currently in the DIS stage 40.60 as of the end of December 2017 when voting on the proposed revision was closed. Ratification of the new standard which will be realigned to the new ISO Directive 1 Annex SL management system structure is expected to be formally released in the summer of 2018. At that point certified entities will enter a 3-year transition period to update to the new version of ISO 20000-1. Topic parts topic 20000-1 Service management system requirements formally ISO IEC 20000-1 to 2011 part 1 includes the design transition delivery and improvement of services that fulfill service requirements and provide value for both the customer and the service provider This part of ISO IEC 20000 requires an integrated process approach when the service provider plans establishes implements operates monitors reviews maintains and improves a service management system SMS The 2011 version ISO IEC 20000-1 to 2011 comprises 9 sections scope normative references terms and definitions service management system general requirements design and transition of new or changed services service delivery processes relationship processes resolution processes control processes topic 20000-2 Guidance on the application of service management systems ISO, IEC 20000-2-2012 provides guidance on the application of service management systems based on the requirements in ISO, IEC 20000-1-2011. 20000-3, Service Providers ISO, IEC TR 20000-3-2012 provides guidance on scope definition, applicability and demonstration of conformance for service providers aiming to meet the requirements of ISO, IEC 20000-1, or for service providers who are planning service improvements and intending to use ISO, IEC 20000 as a business goal. It supplements the advice in ISO, IEC 20000-2, which provides generic guidelines for implementing an SMS in accordance with ISO, IEC 20000-1. 20000-4, Process Assessment Model ISO, IEC TR 20000-4-2010 is intended to facilitate the development of a process assessment model according to ISO, IEC 15504 Process Assessment Principles. ISO, IEC 15504-1 describes the concepts and terminology used for process assessment. ISO, IEC 15504-2 describes the requirements for the conduct of an assessment and a measurement scale for assessing process capability. 20000-5, Exemplar Implementation Plan for ISO, IEC 20000-1 ISO, IEC TR 20000-5-2013 Service providers on how to best achieve the requirements of ISO, IEC 20000-1 Withdrawn 20, Guidance on the application of ISO, IEC 20000-1 to cloud services 
ISO – IECTR 20000-9-2015 provides guidance on the use of ISO – IEC 20000-1-2011 for service providers delivering cloud services. 20000-10 – Concepts and terminology ISO – IECTR 20000-10-2015 describes the core concepts of ISO – IEC 20000, identifying how the different parts support ISO – IEC 20000-1-2011 as well as the relationships between ISO – IEC 20000 and other international standards and technical reports. This part of ISO – IEC 20000 also explains the terminology used in ISO – IEC 20000, so that organizations and individuals can interpret the concepts correctly. 20000-11 – Guidance on the relationship between ISO – IEC 20000-1-2011 and Service Management Frameworks, ITIL ISO – IECTR 20000-11-2015 is a technical report that provides guidance on the relationship between ISO – IEC 20000-1-2011 and a commonly used service management framework, ITIL 20000-12 – Guidance on the relationship between ISO – IEC 20000-1-2011 and service management frameworks, CMMISVC ISO – IECTR 20000-12-2016 Certifications and qualification schemes As with most ISO standards, organizations and individuals seek training towards establishing knowledge and excellence in applying the standard. The certification scheme targets organizations, while the qualification scheme targets individuals. Qualification of individuals is offered by ORS, APMG International, EXIN, PECB, Loyalist Certification Services, TU Sud Academy, PEOPLECERT, and IRCA. The EXIN, Loyalist and TU Sud program is in fact a qualification in IT service management based on ISO, IEC 20000 and includes a foundation level and several role-based certificates, professionals in align, deliver, control and support, associate, executive, consultant, manager and auditor. The APMG qualifications are focused on getting an organization certified and presume knowledge of IT service management is already available. The APMG qualifications are conducted at the foundation, practitioner and auditor level. IRCA and other organizations involved in the certification of auditors have developed their own auditor training and certification for ISO, IEC 20000 auditors. In terms of certification, there are leading certification bodies around the world, for instance, BSI in UK, Quality Austria in Austria, JQA in Japan, KFQ in Korea and SAI Global in Australia, Asia and Americas. <laughs> <laughs> Academic resources International Journal of IT Standards and Standardization Research, ISSN 1539-3054 Internet, ISSN 1539-3062 Print, Information Resources Management Association ISO 20000-1-2011 released at 12 April 2011 ISO – IEC 20000 and Introduction ISBN 978-90-8753-081-5 Implementing ISO – IEC 20000 Certification, the Roadmap ISBN 978-90-8753-082-2 ISO – IEC 20000, a pocket guide ISBN 978-90-77212-79-0 See also ISO – IEC 27001 ISO – IEC 15504 List of ISO standards ISO – IEC JTC1 – SC40 Notes ISO – IEC 20000-1-2011 Service Management System Requirements 
Updated at the 12th of April 2011, replacing ISO IEC 20000-1 to 2005. ISO IEC 20000-2 to 2012 guidance on the application of service management systems. Updated at the 14th of February 2012, replacing ISO IEC 20000-2 to 2005. ISO IEC 20000-3 to 2012 guidance on scope definition and applicability of ISO IEC 20000-1 updated at the 14th of August 2012 replacing ISO IEC TR 20000-3 to 2009 ISO IEC TR 20000-5 to 2013 exemplar implementation plan for ISO IEC 20000-1 updated at the 30th of October 2013 replacing ISO IEC TR 20000-5 to 2010 ISO IEC 20000-6 to 2017 requirements for bodies providing audit and certification of service management systems ISO IEC 20000-8 guidance on the application of service management systems for smaller organizations currently being developed ISO IEC TR 20000-9 to 2015 guidance on the application of ISO IEC 20000-1 to cloud services this international standard gives guidance on application of Part 1 to the cloud. ISO IEC 20000-11-2015N guidance on the relationship between ISO IEC 20000-1-2011 and service management frameworks ITIL ISO IEC TR 20000-12-2016 guidance on the relationship between ISO IEC 20000-1-2011 and service management frameworks CMMISVC technical report topic references topic external links The ISO – IEC 20000 User Group